Hey guys, Oda King Live coming at you again for another uh, anime spotlight video this week. Um, as you can tell, we're going to look at Kino's Journey today because of it apparently being, you know, another season of this badass show coming out. I thought it would be a good time to take a look back at the older one and uh, just take a peek at what you would have gotten, you know, a good 15 years ago or so when you bought it. So this is the collector's edition, of course. Um, as you can tell, it's in the dusty collector's box. It's not in bad shape. A little bit of a little ding here, a little ding there. But this was the ADV release, the four-disc set. Um, I didn't actually even buy this. Uh, one of my buddies bought it. And then when he uh, got out of anime, um, oh my god, I know, right? Um, he sold me his entire collection. So I was you know, buying these box sets for about 10 bucks each off him when... You know, this would have been the time when anime was a bit more expensive. He probably paid around between 60 and 80 for this. So, for the price I was paying, I, you know, I was taken. So, this is a classic show. I uh, I always wanted to actually cosplay from this, but I never knew how, you know, how to. You know, I never was too sure who to do, what to do. I always remember seeing one wicked cosplay. This is 10 more years ago. Um, somebody even had the bike you know did did everything and i was impressed so let's take a peek here oh my god i forgot this was the special edition so we got uh pieces of it flying everywhere all right so it came with the uh you know the bike plate the uh, hermes uh hermes plate here that uh this is actually sick i kind of forgot this was in here all right awesome Okay, so the discs, you know, go a little backwards here. So we got disc one here. Uh, man, the artwork is just nice. Um, all standard white cases. Nothing too exciting um, that way. Um, just standard white, not see-through, same image, you know, reflected. I like the green, though. Um, so that's disc one. Uh, you know... The, generic was it three four episodes of disc um nothing i think it was just like a 13 episode series and you weren't uh you weren't it wasn't too bad i didn't mind the four disc format i'd prefer three but what are you gonna do let's see if probably the same formula oh yeah even the same style green disc that's a little, little disappointing but you know this was the retail market at the time and that's how things rolled i really like the artwork on that one Again, same, you know, duplicate artwork, green disc, same image. It would have been nice if they would have at least changed the uh, the color on the discs. And then this is the same image that was on the, the back of the collector's box there. Drift. Ah, uh, yes, classic. And then the same green disc for disc four. So, if you haven't seen it, I definitely recommend checking it out. Um, it's a different show. Give it a chance. I know um, it is extremely different. Um, it might take a little tiny bit to get into, but trust me, it's it's worth it. You'll enjoy the ride, as, uh, as it says. And uh, that's about it for this one. So, we'll see you uh, next week for another uh, anime spotlight video. Like, comment, subscribe. Let me know if you want to see, you know, what anime you want to see. What, you know, what do you want me to go dig out and... Uh, talk about it and show you what it looked like uh, back in the day of the retail disc market. All right, later.